Hi, my name is Cameron Rudby. Uh, I am a um, CHCI uh, pen tester and red team member here at Devensi Cybersecurity. Um, I've worked here for about a year and I am in the whole uh, cybersecurity scene for about four to five years. Um, what makes the CCT stand out from other certification for me is um, mainly the fact that it is a hands-on uh, certification. It's not simply uh, a MCQ exam. Um, there is this whole um, accent on practicing, on having the labs during the training and having the real world scenarios uh, during the exam. And that for me really um, um, make it stand out from other exams uh, because it is a real world application and I often find uh, similar examples in my day-to-day -day work. I have to say that being uh, in close relationship with uh, EC Council and having uh, taken uh, a, couple of, a couple of exams from EC Council, um, I was not surprised, uh, I say, um, by the content of the, uh, the, lab, the labs and the uh, um, coursework because they are uh, quite extensive and I, I did uh, see the same train with uh, other um, certification from EC Council. Uh, but um, what really intrigued me and really, uh, which I really liked uh, more than surprised, uh, was that yeah, it was real world scenarios and the labs were uh, in fact using real world uh, tools that I use day to day at uh, my pen testing or red teaming job. Um, and it is not that I was surprised, but more that I was um, pleased to see that um, they were using real world. Uh, as tools, real world examples, in order to demonstrate the work of both an attacker and um, a defense technician. Um, so this, yeah, pleased me a lot in the exam. The 85 labs uh, that I encountered during the uh, coursework and during the exam uh, are, I think, a real great asset for such an entry level um, program as the CCD. Uh, simply because uh, it is often hard to um, understand certain concepts uh, without having a real world or hands-on practice. And having these labs that are guided and that gives you um, different flags and different uh, levels of uh, expertise really helps you uh, develop the um, uh, thinking, the thought process that you have to have uh, for a pen testing or uh, an attack scenario to put it uh, globally um, and yeah it really helps train and develop um, the thought process and the whole um, methodology um, to well carry out the attack or carry on the exam um, and having them in an entry-level uh, program such as the CCT I think uh, really helps the students to um, well, grasp the um, element that he's trying to work on or try to learn. And that really helps the students gain in, um, in level uh, much faster than just reading some um, uh, basic coursework. I do believe that not only the CCT can help a student to prepare for CompTIA's uh, Security Plus exam, but also, more generally, um, even the CEH exam. Um, I really do find, having passed the CEH exam myself, that there is a lot of um, uh, elements that we find in the CCT um, that really does help um, having some real-world uh, hands-on time with uh, four uh, exams such as um, the CEH, for example. Um, even for more advanced um, pen testing or uh, network defense um, exams, um, there's a lot of basis and a lot of, uh, well, not only basis, but in-depth examples and in-depth hands-on exams or hands-on um, practical labs uh, that helps the students understand uh, the concept that he's learning about. And that really does help for uh, taking later more advanced uh, exams. As I said before, I truly think that the CCT is the perfect exam to start a cybersecurity career 
um, not only because it is um, quite in-depth and has a lot of bases, uh, but because it gives a lot of hands-on time uh, with different subjects, different um, methodologies. And well, as a starter, it is a great exam to have because, well, you can um, assess that the student have some hands-on practical time and that it is not some um, uh, rehearsed uh, coursework material that he has just learned for the exam and forgot it a, a week after. And well, you have to have some sort of understanding of what you are doing in order to succeed in the exam. And that is for me the basis of the, uh, for me, pen testing job, but also uh, network defense um, uh, positions. And yeah, for me, it is um, one of the best um, starting exams because, well, it gives uh, practical hands on time. And that is what is important on the field. For me, the word that would um, summarize the most CCT is realistic. Uh, simply because it is um, what the CCT is. It is realistic. It gives, um, well, real world examples. It gives real world practical time, practical exams, practical labs. And that is what I am faced with on a day to day basis at my work. Um, and that is for me what is the more, most important thing for a certification. It's not simply a piece of paper that you have because you have uh, followed the coursework for uh, a couple of days. For me, the real added value of having a certification is to attest that you have a certain level, a certain expertise in a particular uh, domain. And that is what the CCT does. It is realistic and it is um, really um, focused on the real world examples. Uh, I could have said that my favorite feature of the CCT was the hands-on labs or uh, practical um, exercises. But actually for me, what I really enjoyed was the actual exam in itself. Uh, it was really refreshing to have an exam that had hands-on exercises and not only an MCQ and really the, the, the way that um, it was presented having uh, the uh, scenario and having to investigate to find um, forensic information, find network um, uh, indicators, find different tools that could be used by a, uh, an attacker. This is really um, a fun way to tackle an exam and I find it was really refreshing and really fun to, to pass, so for me it's the exam. I find that there is a, a recurrent issue with entry level uh, exam in particular is that um, they are scared I think to have too much depth or too much uh, details in their coursework because simply because it is an entry level exam it should remain um, well entry level and gloss over the different topics. Um, what I find really interesting with the CCD is that, well, we are glossing over a lot of um, details and a lot of uh, topics, but we are not only glossing over them, we are really going in depth with a lot of subjects and we have the hands-on material that helps us carry out even further researches and even uh, further learn about different topics, uh, which for me makes the, the program, the, the whole exam, more immersive. And that is why I think as an entry level um, certification, it really does stand out from um, the others that are uh, available on the market. Honestly, the main thing I would like to say is thanks for this uh, certification. It really is refreshing to have such an exam, such a certification uh, with a program that have well hands-on material that has really um, hands-on and really dedicated really uh, precise uh, coursework material um, I really think that um, this exam and this coursework in general uh, gives the students more uh, confidence to tackle higher end certifications such as the CPEN for example uh, because well it is uh, our first step in the CIB security world and it is a first step during which we have hands-on time, we have practical uh, experience, and that helps someone to 
um, well, have the confidence to tackle further exams. And I really think that as a uh, entry level certification, uh, the CCT really brings uh, to the market something that the other certification leaves for, let's say, higher end certification or a more advanced certification. So I really think that it is um, a really good uh, first step uh, in the whole cybersecurity world and a really uh, practical and realistic one. Thank you for your consideration uh, in our ATC for this CCTA um, certification. I would also really like to thank you personally for giving me the opportunity to have this exam and to test it out and to well have the coursework and try it out myself. Um, it really does help someone um, in his self-confidence for other uh, practical exams uh, as I said during the interview and yeah, I would like to finish up by thanking EC Console for uh, this opportunity.